What's up everyone, it's Prometheus, and today I'm coming at you with the three must-have espresso tools for any barista. So whether you're a home or a cafe user, these always come in handy. So let's start out with the dosing funnel. The dosing funnel is just a super simple piece of equipment that saves you time for cleaning up, saves you money for lost coffee. As you can see when you're grinding, it's bouncing off the sides, there's static, there's all that stuff that you don't want to lose. So what you can do is pick up one of these. This one is from Orphan Espresso, but there are other brands. Basically it's set up to be 58 millimeter, which is the diameter of my portafilter. You just drop it right in and bam, you're saving coffee, you're saving time. It's just a nice piece of equipment. As you can see, when I'm grinding into the portafilter, I'm not losing any over the sides. All those pieces that are sticking to it are like little chaff pieces that aren't making a mess of my grinder and my table. It's a win-win. It's really just a simple, inexpensive piece of equipment that's worth having on any bar, home, or cafe. The next piece of equipment is a distribution tool. So these are kind of debated throughout the industry. Some people love them, some people hate them, but I find they're much cleaner and consistent than using my hand to do the stock fleth or the other popular method is tapping uh, to flatten the grounds in your portafilter. Uh, again, you wanna make sure that you have a nice consistent product every time, you're not wasting shots. So using this tool makes sure that I do it the same every time, I do the same amount of spins, I can set the depth, everything is very consistent from shot to shot. Um, there is a debate whether this helps with extraction or vice versa, but in the end, it does help keep things cleaner, keep things faster, and overall just creates a nice bed for tamping. So it's super easy to use, you just set the depth, it fits into pretty much any basket that's 58 millimeter, give it a few spins, and bam, you have a nice flat surface for some nice flat tamping. And speaking of tamping, let's talk about the next piece, a comfortable tamper. So everyone's got a tamper if they have an espresso machine, otherwise you wouldn't be able to use it. They come in so many different shapes, sizes, all those things, but the one thing that I find that's most important is that it's comfortable. It fits in your hand and you can use it consistently. I have quite a few as you can see. Uh, the push tamper is super consistent. It definitely will work for everyone. It'll be the same every time, but I really like the old fashioned style of handling the tamping on my own. So I prefer the Pullman Big Step. It's just a nice tight fit. You have to be careful when you pull it out. You don't want to uh, suction your puck out of the portafilter itself, but it just works so well every time. It creates a nice flat tamp as long as you're paying attention to it. It's pretty much impossible to pull it out crooked uh, because it'll just get jammed in there and it comes out with this nice consistent shots every time. And that's really what we're all going for, right? We want great tasting, consistent espresso every time we pull a shot. So these three espresso tools are the keys to that lock. You wanna unlock your awesome espresso. You wanna make sure you're wasting as little as possible. You're pulling consistent shots. Check these out, they will come in handy. Thanks for watching. Don't forget to like and subscribe. Hit that little bell button for notifications. Follow me on Instagram at Prometheus. The blog at Prometheus.com. New videos every Friday. And as always, stay caffeinated, pony boy.